Yo, what's up, guys? I just finished watching the James Miguel fight against Marco Antonio Paraban. James Miguel got the um, third round stoppage. I think it was a little premature, but um, you know, he 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 hurt Paraban bad. You know, I haven't even seen anyone do that. Um, and uh, the stoppage was probably premature. You know, I think the ref should have let the fight continue a little bit more. Paraban seemed to be pretty. He seemed to be okay. He got up on his feet. And he seemed to be all right, but um, you know it is what it is. You know, there's been a lot of premature stoppages out there, the fights out there. But um, great win win for the gal. I've said before that he needed to make a statement tonight. You know, I figured Carl Farch was gonna be there watching, and um, he needed to make a statement. You know, I mean, until he gets his fight, um, hopefully, I mean, he is Carl Farch's uh mandatory already, but we know Carl Farch wants a big money fight. And honestly, you know, I don't think Carl Froch is like a coward if he doesn't fight him anything. Carl Froch has fought so many guys and beaten so many guys. Um, I respect Carl Froch, you know, for wanting to get a big money fight, you know, especially one with and a fighter that's popular out here. And, you know, he says he wants to fight in Vegas and everything. So I listen, I, you know, I, I mean, I want to see the fight, but, you know, Carl Froch against Julio Cesar Chavez fight would be a great fight too. You know, I, I'm I'm really not upset at anything. I do want to see James Miguel get a shot. Uh I personally would like James Miguel to fight George Groves again because I, I really hated the first fight. I felt like I feel like both of them have improved since the first fight. And I wasn't impressed by neither one of their uh performances in the first fight, okay? Um and I think the second fight will go totally different. You know, James DeGale has been fighting a lot more aggressive lately. Actually, that fight there was the first time I saw George Groves and James DeGale. I seen the fight a long time ago, but that was the first time I saw both fighters. And um, I, I like when I'm seeing more from George uh, James DeGale since that fight, okay? Um, George Groves actually won his fight tonight, too, but he didn't look as impressive as James DeGale. In my opinion, all right. So, um, James Miguel wins TKO against um, Paraban, a, a, a stoppage that needed to happen because he really needed to look impressive, especially with a guy that looked good against you know Jay Lee Ala, Badu Jack, and Saki Obika. You know, um, I know Paraban's kind of like on a losing streak, you know, he's had to draw a couple of losses or whatever since he's been undefeated, but he's never been stopped before, so it's a very impressive win. For James Hagel, okay? So anyway, I'm not going to make it long because there's a lot of videos I got to do. And um, I believe, like, the HBO for the Pacquiao fight has already started. So I might go back and come back and do the Tony Bellew video and stuff after, like, all of the fights are done, okay? But um, I just wanted to get this video quick done out of the way. And um, I'll be back with you guys in a little while, okay? Peace.